Hello and welcome to my channel. My name's Hayley and in this video I'm going to take you through what I pack for a two week holiday in my 30 litre backpack. I'm also going to be showing you what's in my personal bag which is a 16 litre canteen. If you enjoy this video please like and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. So let's get into the video. So here's my personal bag. In the side pocket I have my tripod for my camera. In the other pocket I have my cup that I can put hot drinks in and cold drinks in. In the front pocket I have my bike keys, my purse, my spork and my passport. Lastly, I have a pen, just in case. Moving on to the main compartment. I have my sunglasses. My normal glasses. I have my toiletries bag. I have my makeup bag with very little makeup in it. Next I have my electronics bag. I got this bag on Amazon after seeing it in someone's YouTube video. Lastly, my liquids bag. Now I'm going to take you through everything that's in each individual bag. This is my toiletry bag. I have my razor, my shampoo bar, my moon cup, my nail file, some sanitized wipes, my nail clippers, my toothbrush, a soap bar and my cleanser. I have some toothpicks, some biodegradable nappy bags, my contact lenses, some plasters just in case, q-tips and the tweezers. I try to reduce my waste and my liquids by using soap bars, shampoo bars and cleansers that aren't liquid. Also using my moon cup by preventing waste further. The next bag that I'm going to be going through is my makeup bag. I don't have much makeup with me but it's enough to do me and what I like. I have a highlighter, an eyelash curler, a bronzer which I literally use all over my face, a brush that I use for everything. <laughs> I have an eyeshadow, a liquid eyeliner, pencil eyeliner, satin powder, beauty blender, my eyeshadow brush and my mascara. Lastly, my lipstick. Next bag I'm going to bring you to is my electrical bag. I'll leave the link to this bag in the description as I find it so useful and ever since I got it it's made my life so much easier. First I have my power bank. Then I have my USB-C, standard USB, another USB-C and my camera charger. I have a fast charger, an adapter. Then I have my GoPro. I have this in this little bag my mom got me for Christmas one year. Then I have my camera charger. In this little pouch here I have all my SD cards that I'm going to be using for this trip. I have some Duracell batteries for my light and then just some GoPro accessories. I'll also be adding my Fitbit, my Fitbit charger into this bag. It's just charging while I was creating this video. Mm -hmm. 
Now, the next bag I'm going to bring you through is my liquids bag. First I have some water resistant sun cream, some nail varnish, concealer, and I have my lip balm, my favourite lip balm ever. I have a primer, I have my deodorant, I have my dry shampoo, I have a hair mask for when I'm cycling halfway through my holiday and my hair is about to fall out. A face mask for the same reason. I have some conditioner and I have my Max Strobe Cream. So here are the two small perfumes that I got for free as a sample. If you're ever looking for perfume and just say you haven't brought any with you, just go into the department store if you're buying anything from it. Even if it's like just the smallest thing, they will give you these for free or you can even ask for samples. It's a little trick that I have only found out recently. And that is my 16 litre personal bag packed. Moving on to my 30 litre carry-on. This is the Osprey Tempest 30 litre. This is the female version. I have my two water bottles on either side in each cup holder. In the top pouch I have a dry bag and I also have I also have an extension cord here. This is the best trick that I could ever offer anybody about traveling. All you need is one adapter and then you can plug in as many, well four, <laughs> of your electronics that you need to charge. In the front compartment I have my microfiber towel. These are great towels, they pack up very small and they are quick drying. Now, on the top I have my runners. I have some Nike running runners, they're lightweight and they're breathable. I have them wrapped in these booties just to protect the rest of my stuff in this bag. Inside the shoes I have packed my socks. In the next pouch I have my hair brushes. I have a bob and a fringe which is quite inconvenient when travelling. In my miscellaneous pouch. And then in the last pouch I have all my little bike gear that I can bring on the plane with me and then I have my underwear bag my clothing packing cube in my miscellaneous pouch I have some hair accessories a face cloth a mini hairbrush I have my money bag and my bandana and buff and a little shopper that packs away really small. I have two locks just in case. In my bike pouch I have two packets of electrolytes. These are going to be very useful when we're cycling in 30 degrees heat. <laughs> I have a spare bike tube. And then in this little bag is basically my repair kit. So I have a pump. I have a little repair kit and some tire levers. And this is when I realized I had my, my bike lube in my bag, which it will be packed in my bike box because I don't have any more room in my liquids bag. <laughs> Then I have a tiny Leatherman. The aid on this is below the requirements for carry-on, so I actually can carry this on, which is good, because sometimes you never know when you're gonna need your Leatherman. Now, in my 
clothing packing cube. I have basically <laughs> tried to pack everything I need and whatever I can. I'm only, I'm only bringing the necessities, but I also wanted to bring clothes that were nice, so I had to be really careful with what I was bringing, especially because we're going to be well, I'm going to be carrying all of this, so I didn't want to bring too much. And all the clothes that I have are thankfully quite light, and they fit well in my bag, so it worked out for me. I have six tops, one pair of shorts, one skirt, two, three dresses, and one blazer which is going to act with my little coat. So I also have a light crop jumper and a pair of leggings and my broken socks that I'll be wearing on the plane. So I can mix them around and mix my nighttime layer around. So in this packing cube, which was inside my clothing packing cube, are all my cycling gear. So I have three sports bras, I've got one bikini, which I'll be using when we're going surfing. I have one pair of bicycle shorts and I have one bicycle bib. And here's Ted looking for somewhere else to sleep. He's so cute. I wish he was mine, but he's not. So now I'm just packing everything away back into my 30 litres and as you can see it all fits nice and snug. I really love the Osprey Tempest 30. So here's everything I have packed. I hope this video has helped you in some way. Please comment below if you've got any tips for me that I can use for my next trip. 